Welcome back, everyone. Um, so it looks like I left off exactly where I did last time, but because I accidentally made a boo boo and did assisted mode, I went back and beat it on standard mode. So we're back on standard mode. Yay. And because I'm so smart at, you know, video games and stuff, I managed to get more health thingies because I knew what I was doing and didn't get hurt as much. Nice. And I also found other things like a safe that then had a key, which will go to the locker room. So we have a locker room thing that we can do. Isn't it unfortunate that you have that and now we're locked out of the police station? We're going to go back. Don't worry. <laughs> I mean, yeah, we'll be back there soon. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> also, um, thanks to Mike, um, Leon said that he felt like he was being watched, and now I'm really at unease because now all I'm thinking about is, like, a big giant tank thing just coming to murder my ass. Oh, yeah. I don't know how far we're on, like, the bracket videos, but uh, Travis knows that Mr. X exists... He doesn't know when he comes out and where and what he does, but he knows he exists and he is awesome. I cannot wait. I'm assuming for that I want to explore. Is there anything actually down here? Honestly, yes. During the boss, there's like ammo and stuff, but besides that, no. Like if you scavenged everything, like you got all the ammo and health supplies, then you're good in this little area down here. I think it was like one in the morning when I finished it so i probably <laughs> just wanted to save and didn't scavenge as good as i could have probably because so i know there's a ton of ammo mm, yeah sure. you don't want to miss those grenade oh. what? hell yeah more yeah good thing you came down here travis yeah because that is some handy stuff right there um yeah, because I think there's like a ladder that you climb up, like a new ladder, I want to say. Unless it was that one. I don't remember. I, I don't, don't know, know anything. I don't know anything, Travis. I don't know, man. I've I'm never even heard of this game. I've <laughs> <laughs> never heard of this game. I just decided it's going to be one of my favorite games. Yeah, you know. I, I only play like, Mario. I don't play this trash. Like, you know the whole, like, judging a book by its cover? That's yeah. true. You can't judge a book. But video games. You can judge by their covers. And this cover, garbage. And that's why Hello Kitty Cruisers is one of my favorite games of all time. Right, because if there's not a giant white anime cat on the screen, I don't want to play it. Exactly. Oh, that's the ladder you want to climb up right there, by the way. Okay. Unless that's the same one. Okay. It is the same one, but I think that's still the right one. Okay. I just think you want to go somewhere that you haven't been before. That's usually how games work. Uh, usually. I don't know, because this room you entered when you first came here, so it has to be the way you're going right now. Yeah, because we, like, fell down. Yeah, I remember those days. Yeah. Oh, man. Is it weird that watching this, like, makes me feel warm and comfy? No. No, because you're not in the situation. You I You just guess. know what's going to happen, and you're looking forward to how I'm going to react. That's fair. I guess if I was the one playing and it was my first time, I probably wouldn't feel warm. You know, it's kind of like I always get giddy when I show a new person Outlast because they're like, ooh, I'm not going to be afraid. I'm super cool and tough. That's true. No, you're a pussy and you're going to realize that. <laughs> that is a good point. Yes. Ooh. He said he's so good at climbing ladders. Uh, is this cutscene? Yes. Okay. It is. Oh. I have a feeling Mr. X is going to make an entrance. Pretty he will, soon. eventually. Yeah. I mean, I did tell Travis earlier we're about a third of the way through the game, so you know, at this point, anything could happen. Anything is awesome. Oh, look at all these bright lights. Now you're in the garage. I do not like how open this area is. Is it I, weird that open areas are actually more terrifying to me than closed areas? No, because I totally agree with you there. Because, <laughs> like, anything could come from anywhere, you know? Exactly. Like, There's you no watch safe everywhere. place. Whereas uh -uh. if it's just a tight hallway, I can see if it's bad or not. Yeah, this area oh. sucks, too. Oh, yeah, you can't go that way, silly. You should have known that by the look of the door. Yeah, well... I just want to go home. I know. Can I get out of here, please? Mom! Go ahead. Oh. Well, there you go. 
You don't have your parking. This is like real life, dude. <laughs> this is just look at his face. Shit, I don't have my parking ticket. <laughs> God, God dang it. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, where's my wallet? I gotta get three. Oh. Is a dog Mr. X? <laughs> there he is. <laughs> in the flesh. Well, half flesh. Oh. <laughs> oh. He's very so strong. Oh, tell how loud right. something is based off of uh Nice. The menu. Who was it? Who is that? I'm gonna guess it's uh, the hey, side stop. chick, babe. Hell to the yeah. Oh. He was a good man. Play dead. Lower it. Damn, look at that, Travis. FBI. Oh my god, she's an FBI agent. It's I don't girl. trust her. That oh dog god. does not want to die. <laughs> Like, I know it's a zombie and stuff, but that still f made me feel really sad. I know any Sorry. dog in anything, right? It doesn't. It doesn't feel right. It doesn't have we had well. the conversation on how animal deaths in movies always have a Stop deeper impact than human deaths in movies? I feel like we've probably mentioned it at some point because it is true. Well, because all these humans are assholes. Like that dog was probably a good dog, right? Especially when you think it's in a police hey, station, so it was probably a police dog. Oh, you're so right. And now it's a zomber dog. Are you okay? You're not as good as my poochie, but, you know. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're not the world's greatest dog, but you're all right. Well, because, you know, there's, I mean, except for the exception of Mojo, who I don't think is my favorite dog in the world right now, <laughs> your dog is usually the best dog in the world. Yeah, you seem to have an off-and-on relationship with Mojo. Yeah, it's just when he's being cute and friendly, he's the best. Yeah. However, you don't always get that side of him. <laughs> That's what I say about Matt, too. <laughs> he's sometimes a good boy. Yeah, sometimes he can be really cute and friendly. Other times, he's just a bit of an asshole. I'm there map, you go. I'm a map. I'm the map. Yeah, it's just that big area. Ugh. Yeah, welcome to the new area. You're going to spend the your next, like, two hours in the parking garage. Panel? Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, well, tr it's not as bad as it sounds. It's going to be so many zombie doggos. Honestly, I don't even remember that many zombie doggos in this game. Okay. Like, there's That's a few. There's a lot outside, but not inside places. Okay, so red means there's still things I need to do. Yeah. And find. You might not be able to do them right away, though, just an FYI. Right. I okay, want to say. Blue means I can go there, so I can go over yeah. there. And then white is locked. Or white, white means, is I never tried. Yeah, white is you never tried. Red is locked. White is you've never tried. Blue is you've done God dong done it before. Oh, look at this. See, that's not sad at all. Right? I can look, I can look at that and laugh. Ha! Ha! Pleb. What an ass. Run away. <laughs> oh. I do kind of feel bad for the prisoners. Like, look, yeah. They, well, they were just stuck here. Like... Then how did they get bit and turn into zombies if they were st oh well, I guess I guess they were probably tested on. No, that doesn't make sense. How did these guys turn into zombies? I don't know, I guess they were sticking their hands through trying to escape and then got bit what yeah, that's dumb. Never mind. Yeah, that's you guys what they suck. Did. Take me, please. <laughs> Sympathy is gone, you guys are idiots. Yeah, if anything, you think this would be the safest place to be right now. Is inside a locked cell. How ironic. Safest place to be is in your prison cell. Yeah. Well, there you go. I mean, I'm assuming none of these are actually openable, but... Uh, I don't remember. Oh, Hello? this one might And be... then there's this guy who's Look like... Look at this guy. I just... I kept my hands myself. I'm still alive. I'm, I'm having a nice smoke. Hello, <laughs> yeah, I'm just hanging out in here. Ike is a little ponytail. No. Yeah, all the other assholes stuck their hands out, but I didn't, so I'm fine. Yes. Yeah. Of course I insect you. you know, up until now, where <laughs> now I feel safe. Is he still around? Leon's gonna bite him. Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by That's what I would do if I was in this world. I would just bite people. Yeah, just kidding, I'm not a zombie. Prank you. Uh, but you want to get that checked. <laughs> I do have rabies, so. How's about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass? Damn, this guy's cool. The same thing to him, I guess. Where do you get the cigarettes from? He's inside a prison cell. 
I don't know. And how did he light it? Does he have like a lighter on him too? Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. I guess. No other way out of that Believe Ooh, this guy seems parking. very official for a guy locked in a prison cell. I have to talk to the chief first. Yeah, he seems legit. Also, why is there a prison like right connected to the parking garage? So either we play nice and help each other out. I mean, Shit. our school campus What's had that. What? What's coming? Come on. I guess. But not like this. Well, yeah, not to this extent, obvious. And granted, I guess it is a police. To oh, well. No, leave him alone. So that's Mr. X. Oh. Oh my God. Right? There's oh. no way that's not Mr. X. Uh. Mr. Giant ass arm that just broke through a brick freaking wall. No, no, we've all done that before. Let's not. It's let's not me. get ahead of ourselves. Oh, and then she's her. just like, yeah, everything's cool. It was her. <laughs> You're Mr. X. I told you to get out. Oh, poor guy. Take the sunglasses off. You knew him. But she's so hungover right now. She probably is. To my investigation. I mean, it's almost the weekend. Man, I cannot take her seriously in a trench coat. I feel like she's gonna flash us. I mean. Don't you tease me with that. <laughs> Leon. I mean, if it was black, movies. this would like literally be the Matrix look. Leon. That, you're not wrong. It's too late. I know, right? Then we'll talk. I just realized they have the same hairstyle. Name's Ada. <gasps> Coincidence? I think not. Are you my sister? <laughs> Actually, you're my twin. <laughs> Identical twin sister. <laughs> oh, so you need to get that parking permit, I guess. Okay. Hey, can he buddy. not, like, get his way in? in uh, yeah, can you bring that to me, please? I need that. Yeah, um... <laughs> come on. Yeah, stop being an asshole. I need that, please. Oh, no. <laughs> what a guy. Okay, yeah. well, I found a tool, so that's cool. Yeah, hey. It's well, always nice to find uh, an Eric. <laughs> oh! I feel like we always pick on Matt, so I, I decided to choose a new name. Pick on the guy that hasn't been around for like three years. Exactly. He won't even call me out on it. <laughs> that is true. Because out of Cause all he's of us, a tool. there's no chance he's watching this video right now. So, However, I'd just be super happy that like in a month from now when it actually gets uh, released, that he'll just message me. I'm not a tool. Yeah. G guys, I'm not a murderer. <laughs> That's what Matt did. Yeah, I, I was going to say, that was <laughs> awesome. I don't know if you guys know this, but like... There was a video, I think it was me, Nick, and Travis, maybe someone else, this was a while ago, and uh, we were talking about Matt, we were saying that Matt has murderous tendencies, and uh, I mean, Matt messaged us like a couple weeks later saying, guys, I'm not really a murderer. Guys, I, I'm not really a murderer. And I think we all had the same reaction of, what, you watch our videos? <laughs> <laughs> I know, it wasn't, oh, I feel bad, it was, oh my god, you watch our shit? Yeah, wait, you weren't supposed to watch that, Matt. <laughs> you well, drop much? Because that was the time period, like, when Matt was gone. You know, that little middle period. So we kind of just assumed he was, like, gone, gone. You know what? I think a grenade will fix this issue. Absolutely. Just stick mm -hmm. it right in there, and you're good to go. There you go. Just crank it, baby. Exactly. I mean, it's metal, right? It'll <laughs> conduct the wires. Yeah, you would think. Or some gunpowder. <laughs> okay, so I'm, like, stuck here. You're stuck in this so room? I have to be able to find something. Yeah, you need to go get, like, the power parts and stuff. Okay. And they're they're hidden away. Of course. As per horror game tendencies, you got to go, like, to the other end of the level. All I want. It just work, damn it. Right. One of these times it will. I know. What a, what a horror game trope. Like, you got to fix the electricity in the room. Name, Have you? I mean, other than Outlast, name one other horror game. Uh, did, may, maybe not Amnesia. Well, Amnesia had candles. That counts. Oh, yeah, oh. yeah. Between the uh, candles and uh, uh, just your lantern having to get oil. That's Ugh. true. It's just old school lights. It counts. Travis, you really are lost, aren't you? I really am. <laughs> Um, let's see. If only you had a map. You know. Am I just dumb and... 
No, you have to go back to the parking garage. <coughs> I thought I tried that door already. <laughs> <coughs> I was like, uh, just go forward, sir. Hmm. This is a nice room. Right. I like it. I'm going to stay here. Yeah, I'm going to stay here forever. Until all the zombies are gone. This Let's Play is over, guys. Well, we'll see you never again. <laughs>